Hey guys, welcome back. Um, today is Friday, January 8th, and what we're going to do is we're going to review Africa's climate and the West African empires for a quiz today. Um, I'm going to go through what exactly is on the quiz, and then I have um, the link in the Google Classroom assignment um, for the, the Kahoot, <laughs> can't ever say it, the Kahoot review. And then, um, well, let me just go to the next page. <laughs> All right, so um, anyways, you have the, we're kind of reviewing right now, then you have um, your quiz, and then you have um, also the link in Google Classroom for a West African um, folktale that I read with students every single year. Um, it's called Anansi the Spider. And this is more so of an article about um, the significance of Anansi the Spider, but um, it does give you parts of the story. Um, and that's a reading with like five questions on read work. So you want to make sure you get that done as well. Um, today is National Bubble Bath Day. So if you have a time to relax, take a bubble bath. All right, so what's going to be on the quiz, essentially? This is what's going to be on the quiz. So uh, there's going to be a couple questions. I believe two questions on the geography of Africa. There is going to be some questions about Ghana, Mali. Oh, it's on there twice. Well, look at looky there. Should be Songhe. Songhe. Sorry about that. There's 11 multiple choice questions, and then there's one sort. So it'll say Ghana, Mali, and Songhai, and then there's some descriptions on the side, and you have to drag and drop. Um, this is from the chart that I told you the other day to make sure you study for the quiz. So the chart that says Ghana, Mali, Songhai, and it has descriptions of those empires in them. So study that chart as well. It's not part of the Kahoot, um, so you want to make sure you're studying it on your own. Um, and then there's one short answer, um, and the short answer question is, why was it important for Songhai to capture the Trans-Saharan trading routes? Um, I'm telling you now so you can maybe think about it before you take the quiz. One thing that is extremely important that even when I can say it five million times and people still don't do it, this the answer to this question should have at least three complete sentences if i can't answer it in less than three sentences i know you can't so you want to make sure that you have at least three complete sentences for full credit on that question if you do not have complete sentences or you do not have three sentences you will lose a point if you don't have three sentences and they're not complete sentences you're just going to get a zero on that question. So make sure you are meeting those expectations. What's next? So we, I kind of went over what's going to be on the quiz. Um, Kahoot Review, which is in the Google Classroom assignment, and Anansi the Spider, which is in the Google Classroom assignment as well. So make sure you, um, I would definitely take advantage of the Kahoot Review. Um, the last review I did, it was very clear people did not take advantage of that review. So um, hopefully the Kahoot gives you some more um, more um, timely feedback um, for you to help you answer those questions. Um, and that's pretty much it. So quiz, or I'm sorry, review, quiz, Anansi. And then I will see you all Monday. Um, Monday, we're going to be watching a um, TV show together. So if you remember the um, World Wars where the video was playing, but I was like still narrating and pausing and, you know, elaborating. Um, that's the same thing. So it's not like I'm just posting a video and not doing anything. <laughs> I'm going to watch um, the video with you. We'll have pause points um, and you'll be answering some questions about that. So you all have a wonderful weekend. Do something fun. Um, relax. I guess make up any work you didn't do. Um, and then I will see you all Monday. Bye, guys.